Starting with the moss brick, which makes up the structure of the compost wall, I made a natural corn syrup adhesive to bind the moss to create the moss brick. Continuing on, the compost makes up a big part of the design. First, I had three vine stations which allowed me to observe and study the growth and behavior of these vines. There were vines all over my neighborhood, which made it easier for me to study the different types of vines available. From my earlier observations, I realized that some have stronger tensile strength than others. White sap, having properties of latex, secretes itself once the branches have been punctured. And insects or animals that engage with the vines. After two and a half months, the gardeners cut down all the vines, which made me become interested in the idea of pruning. Next was sound. I was experimenting with different materials and how they absorb sound better than generic bricks, concrete, and etc. From my experiments, I realized that reindeer moss absorbs sound by a significant margin. The silent wall allows for people to store their compost and reuse it whenever they need to. Sound is absorbed through many ways. One is through the structure that is composed of the moss bricks, compost that is embedded within, and vines that will grow against the compost wall component. The joining of all these assemblies allow for a social component, which is the interaction between neighbors to work collectively and to enjoy white noise from the rustling of the leaves. Thank you.